us together in a moment. We three, and maybe some of you, are on journeys. Friends, might you be so good as to an old man? Too late! Too late! Oh, Mr. Wilson, please don't tell him! Don't tell him what, man? That you're from Scotland! Shh. Has someone died? Sir? It's true, I come from Scotland. But I'm afraid I cannot help it. That, sir, is what I find a great number of your countrymen cannot help. <laughs> You're reading it, Boswell. Don't pretend you don't like it. I don't. It's sentimental. Emotional, perhaps. <laughs> There's a difference. I enormous. Either way, not a genre I admire. I must strive to become worthy of this great man. Too true. One, a font of wisdom. The other, a prattling gossip. One, a flame of insight. The other, barely a spark. <laughs> Still, it began. The unlikely, incalculable friendship. Would you go with me someday, sir? Yeah, go with you where, sir? Not to hell, I hope. <laughs> no, indeed. To my homeland, Scotland. Why? Christmas, you do him so winningly, so warmly, uh, that he could not help but be persuaded. Ten years later, he agreed. <laughs> all in all, the weather was. Uh, how shall I put it? The weather was. Uh, Dreadful. Unsatisfactory. Scottish. <laughs> Less <laughs> than ideal. These conversations. This is what people said, and did. Still do? Both men feel so real. The past may present. It speaks to me. <sighs> Boswell, he's so... So... Holy human. That it. Human. I have met many examples of humanity, Boswell. I have many friends. There are few to whom I take as much as you. Looking back, had it not been for certain forks in my road, certain pilgrimages, I would not be standing here today. Journeys help us realize who we are, not who we thought we'd be.